everybody, welcome back to another edition of Matchbox Marks Diecast Restorations. So, this ambulance I got from my buddy Dan Russell. As you know, a while ago he sent me a whole box of ambulances. And this was one of them, I believe. I know you sent it to me, Dan, but I can't remember which package. But anyway, you know, this has been in my box for a while. And I was looking at it, and I'm like, well, what can I do with it? Well, Obviously, this one is in uh, extreme disrepair, so I'm going to make it a convertible, and I'm going to see what I can do with it. It's just going to be a fun little project, and it's going to be more practice than anything, so all right, stay tuned. All right, so here comes the ambulance. We're going to officially decommission it <clears throat> because it's... Uh, I think the insurance company would agree it's going to cost more to bring it back to ambulance state than if we just customize it. So, anyway, here we go. This thing is in total disrepair. I did drill out the rivet. One rivet. And I'm sure most of you have seen these a thousand times. So, anyway, I always like taking them apart. So, uh, the window is still in there. So that'll probably come right out. I'll probably just break it out. I'm going to save the beacon too. Those are always hard to find. And here's the uh, interior. So obviously I need to do something with the back. So I'm not too sure what I'm going to do. Maybe I'll make it a pickup truck. Who knows? So alright. So stay tuned as I uh, chop off the roof. All right, so here's all the pieces to the ambulance custom. So there's the tires, here's the roof. Like I said, that'll go in the old scrap pile. Tires, got a little paint on them, but I'm gonna paint them black anyway. Not gonna do a tire swap, because these, these tires are too teeny to do a tire swap. So anyway, there's the base, the interior, and don't know what I'm gonna do yet with the interior. Uh, I don't know. One thing about doing this, or these, these kinds of builds, man, sky's the limit. So, alright, so the next uh, shot will be the reveal. I'm not going to do any in-between, so it'll be a good surprise. Well, it'll be a surprise for me, too. So, anyway, alright, stay tuned for the final reveal, but before we do that, let's take a look at what we uh, started with. All right, before the uh, final reveal, let's take a look at what she looked like before. So obviously the old Cadillac Ambulance, one of my favorite castings ever. And a yeah, homemade paint job, not too bad actually. I kind of am digging the red and silver combination. So anyway, let's take a look at what we ended up with. All right, it is time for the final reveal of my little caddy ambulance custom. So, you know, I was trying to figure out what to do with the back end where they put all the uh, all the people when they're being transported. So I thought to myself, well, I'm going to make it into a really nice stereo system. So let's start off in the beginning. So obviously uh, the rims or the hubcaps were all painted red from before. So I replaced the uh, axles. Did a two-tone uh, two paint job. Uh, chromed out the front and the rear. Painted the rear taillights. Uh, chopped off the roof. And uh, let me see if I can get a close-up here. So the speaker material is made out of that mesh material that I use for my uh, prison transport buses and in the middle there are like little clear gemstones and those are actually supposed to be lights so when you're rolling down the road jamming your tunes you can have them all lit up and the speaker covers are washers I just painted them black and that's styrene I offset the color with a metallic red kept the original interior but I had to chop it and I had an extra window, so I cut that off. So it does have a little bit of original equipment on it. So there it is, uh, the Caddy Custom uh, with a good sound system. So this is actually pretty fun. 
And actually, before I started this process, I didn't know what I was going to do with this casting. I don't ever like throwing castings away. Uh, there's always hope for them. So anyway, this, this was fun. So I hope you like it. Uh, well, if you do like it, hit the like button, subscribe, all that good jazz. I appreciate you watching, my new uh, subscribers, my faithful subscribers. And stay safe during this crazy times. And, and I'll see you on the next one. Stay tuned.